Hi there, Virgo, and welcome back to Star Lord is Tarot. This is your tarot forecast for the week of September, or, sorry, October the 7th through to the 13th. I went ahead, shuffled the cards, laid them all out. Let's see what's going on for Virgo. First up, we have Major Arcana of the Lovers in the upright, followed then by the Ace of Pentacles upright. And next we have the Six of Wands in the upright with the Two of Pentacles upright. And lastly, we have the Page of Cups in the upright. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and interpret this read for you. First of all, Virgo, for your overall energy, you have that of the Gemini card, the lovers in the upright position. And maybe you're dealing with a, a Gemini. They had a pretty um, love-filled... <laughs> A loved a love filled reading for this week so um, the lovers card is all about the choice and I think you guys got the choice card in your monthly or last week I know that uh, it came up for Virgo this is all about having to make a decision or a choice about something now for some of you it's definitely concerning a relationship uh, excuse me for others of you it could be uh, concerning a business partnership or choosing to partner up with um, could be a new company or something like that maybe you're if you're uh, you have your own business you're self-employed maybe you're choosing to partner up with a company or uh, it could be another person maybe that's you're thinking thinking about taking on as a business partner um, there's a choice or there's a decision made maybe in a relationship there we can always choose to love choose not to love we can choose to take our relationship to the next level we can choose to you know get involved in a relationship or not so there's some type of choice here in the week ahead for you Virgo coming right off the hop we do have the ace of Pentacles here in the upright position this is all this is all about a new beginning in the tangible things in life so even if it's concerning a relationship this choice maybe um, this choice could be the beginning maybe this partner that you're thinking of partnering up with if if you are this could be somebody who's um, has a lot of potential in the uh, area of, of uh, making money or uh, just security stability it could be a very sta stable person it could be a very stable choice you're making for others of you this could be the new beginnings of an investment maybe you're choosing to go with an investment firm or something like that but it's a good choice the ace of pentacles is here representing something new that could begin be beginning the ace of pentacles sometimes can point to inheritance maybe some of you got some extra money and you're trying you're wanting to now invest uh the your uh your coin into something but the ace of pentacles says whatever it is you're investing in is strong and stable whether it be a relationship or whether it be a home or a business or whatever it is you're about to uh embark on it's definitely something that could um uh definitely bring in uh, big dividends down the road say for example if you're purchasing a property right now it could be that you get it at a good deal and you're able to resell it later at a, a nice profit or whatever the situation even if it's investments or um, a solid relationship <laughs> and it's paired up with the uh, six of wands in the upright position this is all about um this is definitely about achieving some kind of victory it's pats on the back work well done uh, being well received it can indicate a lot of attention coming your way this is about a victory for some of you this could just be a lot of attention maybe because you've stepped into the realm of a relationship and you're making it official or others of you you could be partnering up with something or taking a new opportunity and building it into something a new career a new job what have you uh, a new home a new investment but you're definitely being victorious in it so beautiful so far so good you i'm pretty sure you guys got a really good <clears throat> monthly for october and the two of pentacles is here now and the two of pentacles is representing harmony in the midst of change so whatever is going on here virgo you're in harmony with it 
if it's something new that you're starting up or if you're doing something in addition to such as uh, taking on a course as well as working or if you're doing two different jobs or your uh, regular your day job and you're taking on a side job that kind of situation whatever it is um, you're doing so harmoniously this can also be uh, representative of balancing out the checkbook so whatever's going on looks like a very good decision is being made here uh, Virgo and it's something that you've maybe weighed out and you see the benefits of it now and it's doable and the last card you have up here is the page of cups in the upright position that's another reason why i said you might be dealing with a gemini the gemini also got this card too the page of uh, cups in the upright position beautiful energy it is a court card so it could be representing a person because representing a person is water energy that of cancer scorpio pisces sun moon rising male or female now this could represent a child who's being incredibly sweet it is weekend energy maybe if you're uh, spending some quality time with your own child or grandchild or niece nephew godchild or whatever the special one in your life maybe this person is being incredibly sweet towards you the page of cups can also point to someone who's being incredibly shy but um the page of loves uh, the page of cups loves like he's never been hurt it's very sweet uh, very authentic energy so it could be someone has a crush on you Virgo and they're sending you cute little love notes or they could be sending you messages but maybe they're just sort of like shy or immature messages <laughs> because the person doesn't know how to like come full on and and be um be mature about things so interesting very sweet and also very productive uh week for you virgo lovely reading and in closing i am going to pull an oracle card from you for you from the aqua oh i can't even speak today i think i'm just rushing my speech too much from the wisdom oracle deck i am going to be pulling your card and see what your <laughs> soulmate <laughs> that's your special card for this week virgo soulmate could be some soulmate energy around for virgo <laughs> okay maybe that's what the big choice and decision is about here so that is your reading i hope it helped you if it did please feel free to like share and subscribe otherwise i will see you next week bye bye for now